A carnival can be seen as a process of becoming. This from Reverend Clifton Rollins of the Diego Martin United Church, who explored the many meanings of the festival in a lecture on Thursday. He said carnival has been characterized as both demonic and on the flip side as a boon to creativity. In his lecture, however, the man of the cloth says that Jesus Christ came for sinners and he suggests that the church should not leave absconders behind in the fray of their abandoned revelry. If the good people remain by themselves, then how is the church supposed to be salt and light to the world when the salt refuses to be mixed or the light runs from the darkness? The demon must be named in order for it to be exorcised, especially the demons of an oppressive system manifested in the carnival portrayals, which demons deny a place in the oikumene to other of God's children. Reverend Rollins says despite the immorality that taints certain aspects of carnival, the compassionate spirit of the Lord cannot be pushed aside to please Puritan souls. And Jesus' ministry was one of engagement with the undesirables of society, the outcasts, the jamatized culture, with prostitutes, publicans, lepers, and beggars. But if the church refuses to see, then it lives in a false reality which segregates God's people into those who are good to keep and those who are good to throw away. If the good people, he says, do not do more to understand the many strands of the carnival festival, this would show the failure of the church to understand the complex nature of this phenomenon, and they would be lost to salvation.